Hey there guys, Saror here, and today we're going to be talking about all the games that I'm really looking forward to in 2014, and a couple of them I'm not sure if they're coming out in 2014 or if it's going to be, you know, early 2015. I'm not sure, but these are the games that I'm really looking forward to. So first of all, we have Titanfall. It's an FPS game, and I've heard from a couple of, uh, you know, primarily Call of Duty YouTubers, and they said that it might be the COD killer. And, you know, the FPS genre, as well as any other game genre, in my opinion, can always use a fresh restart. Um, you know, I'm not sure if there's going to be a single-player mode or not. Um, I could All the stuff that I found and read about was about the multiplayer, so... I'm not really sure if it's uh, going to be just all online multiplayer or what, but it looks really awesome. So that's going to be the first game I'm looking forward to. My next game is a game called No Man's Sky. Um, I'm not sure if it's coming out in 2014 or not. It might be coming out in 2015. I'm not really sure. Couldn't really find a definite release date or even an estimated one. But the game is procedurally generated. It's created on the, f it's created from an algorithm, and that basically means the content in the game is created on the fly rather than before the game is released. So you know it's just always changing. And basically, you can discover planets, um, and so can other people. And you know you can all explore them, and it's really cool, and it looks freaking amazing. I can't wait for the game. Um, my next game is going to be Star Citizen, because that game, I've seen some gameplay from it already, and it looks freaking amazing. It's a crowdfunded game, it made $30 million from its crowdfunding, and it looks awesome. Um, it might not be all out in 2014 from some of the stuff that I've read, but it's definitely going to be playable by the end of the year, which I'm really looking forward to, because that game looks freaking amazing. I can't wait for it. Um, my next game is Destiny. It's made by the Halo creators, otherwise known as Bungie, and it's uh, kind of a shared world shooter, and it was kind of described to have some MMO elements, and they kind of tried to stay away from calling it an MMO, but really what that game reminds me of is just um, Borderlands, you know, that game, you know, it's just like, you can all just play together and just have a great time, and the game has some events that aren't planned or controlled by the developer, which it kind of makes the game feel alive in a sense and that's something that uh, I think is going to be a really good step forward in the gaming universe or uh, in just the gaming community, you know, having a game that's kind of alive. So that game, I'm really looking forward to that one. Um, now my next game is Homefront 2. Um, it's a sequel to the first Homefront and it came out in about 2008, 2007, I can't really remember when. But um, basically in the first one, the North Koreans come over to the United States and take over. Uh, it's basically Colorado. You pretty much have to fight for your survival. And I honestly never got through the first game, even though I really wanted to. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to get through it here on PC, because that game is freaking awesome. And I can't wait for the second one, because with the limited amount of time that I played on the first one, I had a lot of fun with it. And it just looks really really awesome so that's something that i'm really looking forward to my next game that i'm really looking forward to and i feel like a lot of people i know are going to be looking forward to this one too is tales from the borderlands um this game looks freaking awesome it's got the same art style as far as i can tell from the original borderlands games and um it's pretty much a prequel to those games and uh, I still have to get into those, but um, it's a prequel, and you know you're gonna hear about, uh, you're gonna hear or see about the characters that you hear about in first and second Borderlands, and all of that stuff, and you're just gonna be able to get a huge prequel into that big universe, and that's something that's gonna be really awesome. So I can't wait for that game. It looks freaking amazing. And my last game is Dying Light. Now I couldn't really find much on this. I don't know if I just wasn't searching hard enough or what was going on. But, um, it's a game about parkour and zombies, and, you know, parkour is awesome, so, you know, there's that, and then so are zombies. But this is going to be the end of the video, guys. If you like the video, go ahead and drop a like and a comment with a rating. If you really like the video, go ahead and subscribe for more content, and I will see you guys all later. Bye!